Hey everyone, sorry I haven't been as active. I caught a nasty upper sinus infection, it's kind of kicking my ass. But regardless, I just had to, I had to do this video because it's too good to pass up. Tim Pool did a video on this story right here. You see it's on the Timcast channel, CA Law Passes Law, Human Human Composting in the Soil. And uh, in this video, he's just exceedingly squeamish about the whole thing. Uh, downright girly in some instances, in my opinion. And I don't mean that as an insult to Tim. I like Tim. I think he's generally uh, got the got the the right perspective, the correct perspective. He's very truth-centered. Uh, there's just some things about his personality and uh, principles of work that I disagree with. But overall, I think he's a good dude. But uh, watching this video, man, I just had to make a video to comment on his version. Well, not his version. His commentary on this story. California is doing this law to uh, fight the climate change. You know, we got to fight the big bag global warmsies. And Tim is the thing that Tim is grossed out by is the idea that uh, under this bill from California, you could compost people and then it's legal to use that soil to grow crops for human consumption. And <laughs> the idea that this is somehow gross or unnatural or. Uh, just, I think Tim's whole thing, after watching this whole video, I think his whole thing, he, he just thinks it's gross. And I got news for you. Everything you've ever eaten, ever, was grown or nourished from dead things. The dirt in your backyard is the compost of millions of years. That's just how it is. The best soil is soil that's got a lot of organic dead shit in it. That's just how it is. And in a climate, uh, economic climate, where we are facing food shortages, where we are facing fertilizer shortages, and where the U.S. needs to find ways to be completely independent from foreign dependence on energy and food, I personally see nothing wrong with ethically composting people and using them in farm soil. I just don't. Feed them to pigs. I don't give a fuck. You use human corpses to fatten pigs. I just do not fucking care. That's the circle of life. Everyone will eventually become food. That's just how it is. You think... You think that, uh... You know, most people are going to end up like pharaohs entombed for tens of thousands of years and then end up in a museum. That is a one in billions scenario. 99.99999% of humans who ever lived or ever will live will eventually, in one way or another, become food. Whether they're eaten by animals, whether they're eventually decomposed into soil. That's just the circle of life. And I would actually love to see a bill at the federal level that allowed for humans to be turned into compost and distributed to farms. Or humans to even be fed to uh, pigs or other livestock that will eat meat. I think pigs are the only one that will actually eat human, though. Yeah, so unless we started farming <laughs> some kind of predator animal, which you wouldn't want to do because predator animals don't taste good from what I hear. But yeah, I just... I had to do a, a quick video talking about this because the there is no scientific reason not to do this. A properly decomposed human body does not spread disease. There is no ethical reason to do this because, like I said, we all end up turning into food anyways. And the idea that there's the Catholic Church is apparently against this. The idea that there's some religious reason not to do this. Sorry. I'm not buying it either. That's all I got for you guys. This might be the only video today because, like I said, this upper sinus infection is kind of kicking my ass. But rest assured, I'll be back soon as soon as I can. In the meantime, thanks for being here. Welcome to the adventure.